Kent, the Garden of England, and home to air rifle aficionado Frank Underdown. I use an FX Cyclone 177 air rifle, and um, I think it's just a job for the for the job I do. The um, Pigeon decoys, uh, for air rifle shooting, dead birds are the best. But um, if you can't get uh, dead birds, flock decoys are not so bad. And um, make your own decoys up with, uh, like I do from a whirly, with uh, a plastic shell with real pigeons on the wings. With, um, with using an air rifle, you don't disturb anybody, and um, where with the shotgun you can hear it two miles away. And it's so much friendly for the people around, and um, nobody knows you're there. I, um, I shoot a pigeon. I eat pigeon, it's, uh, it's a very good meat to eat and uh, all my neighbours like pigeon and so um, I'm not one for shooting big numbers these days. You can enjoy yourself and uh, shoot a few pigeons, eat a few pigeons and everybody's happy. What pigeon shooters or any shooters have got to be aware of is racing pigeons coming into your pattern and ferals. Ferals are a pest at times, but you've got to make sure it is a feral pigeon and not a racing pigeon. We set the decoys out in a pattern, but um, all you can do is to change the pattern around until you get them to come in. I've put a nodder up, it's just got to be trial and error. Another thing for the air rifle shooter, you've got to get the pigeons to land, so obviously you've got to have a good hide and um, good camouflage and because uh, any the slightest movement because as soon as the pigeon comes amongst the decoys he has a look round and if you're not hit up he'll be away. And it wasn't just the pigeons that were drawn into the pattern on the summer stubble. These crafty Covids were completely unaware of our hide. In a few hours with Frank, we gained an insight into what makes a good pattern, what makes a good decoy, and how good a good air rifle can be with a good sight and a good marksman behind the trigger. We've just been out shooting, been enjoying ourselves, got a few pigeons and um, it's been good company. And uh, being as I'm 80 year old, it's time for me to enjoy myself, and which I do most afternoons. <laughs>